Hey, how's it going everyone? Nick Baldwin here from Command Your Consulting and I'm super excited because the long-awaited Conversion Monster integration with Command is finally here. Well, you guys don't have it yet, uh, but it's in beta. We've been testing it out and it's working really, really well. And I wanted to take this opportunity to show you how it works, how you on the agent side is going to set that up within campaigns to let Conversion Monster know that this is a lead you want them to interact with. And then I'm going to show you what it looks like once they qualify that lead. And in between that, what it looks like when they're following up and making those phone calls and text messages. So I'm going to share my screen with you guys and I'm going to jump right in and show you a little bit about what you can expect from this integration. All right. So first, when you're creating an ad or a campaign within command, there's going to be a new setting. It's going to be lead settings. You're going to see that within your campaigns. But let me scroll up to the top so you can kind of see where that falls uh, in, in the line of uh, creating your campaign. So, of course, you're going to choose your listing. Uh, you're going to add your text. Then you're going to add your media, your Facebook and Instagram settings. This is where you're uh, going to target and put your link for the destination. And then you're going to have lead settings. And this is what you want to happen to those leads when they come into the system you're going to assign tags. And it's very important once you launch Conversion Monster, obviously you have to get in touch with the Conversion Monster, they have to activate it within your, within your command account. And then once that's activated, you are going to assign tags. When it's activated, a tag CM-start will be in your system. So when you come to this auto tag uh, portion, you're going to type in right here, you're going to type in CM start. So if I took this off, let me just show you how that works. CM dash start. Okay. That's the tag that I'm going to use. So conversion monster knows to start engaging with that lead. The moment it comes into your database, all of these other tags that you assign to it will be added too. but it's important that the CM start tag is added because as soon as that lead comes in, that tag is automatically added and it alerts Conversion Monster to instantly start following up with that specific lead. Okay, so then when they start following up, you'll start to see this kind of thing going on in your notes under the leads that they're that they're reaching out to. So you'll see um, here, let me scroll down a little bit here. You'll see, yeah, you'll see, let's see, okay, great. You'll see this conversion monster um, started uh, this text message. Okay, so they sent this text message out. It says outbound. And then uh, that was at 8.17 p.m. Then at 8.32, uh, they, they made a phone call. And then it looks like at 8.33, they set the appointment. So it says appointment only hot lead email sent to Nick Baldwin at kw.com. So this was a lead that they actually qualified for me. Pretty amazing. And I'll show you how it looks like when you check your email. When you check your email, you're going to see something that looks like this. You're going to see their name, email, phone number. And then, of course, you're going to see lots of information because the ISA would have had this conversation with them. Are they working with a realtor? Are they looking to buy or sell? When are they looking to buy or sell? Where are they looking? Are they pre-approved? What's their price range? Um, any specific features or amenities they might need? And then, of course, it says the ISA name. Uh, that's typically not the name that the ISA will use when they're on the phone. Uh, I think they use, like, you know, Alex. <laughs> We're all familiar with Alex. If you've, um, you know, gotten Zillow leads or used any other follow-up program like this, just because it's a name that can be attributed to a man or a woman. And so you never know um, who is going to be following up. So it makes it easier for you. And then there's some notes that the ISA, uh, has taken for you just from asking basic questions. So she's, this woman's waiting for a co-signer to start working with, uh, and to start the process. She spoke to someone who 
can give her financing and she's got a down payment of a hundred thousand dollars. She's relocating from New York. She's not under contract with an agent and she can speak at 12 PM tomorrow on the phone. So this is what it's going to look like when conversion monster starts intercepting and nurturing your leads. So you're tagging the lead. Uh, I'm sorry. You're tagging the campaign with CM start as you're building the campaign out. And then you'll start to see some interaction uh, when Conversion Monster immediately starts to follow up when those leads come in. And then you will get a qualification once they get that person on the phone or have a conversation through text. Now, if they have a conversation through text, you'll be able to see that conversation right here in the timeline of the lead. So you'll be able to see that. But if they have a phone call, you know, you won't obviously see the phone call transcript, you'll see the phone call transcript in the form of this email that sends you all the information that you need to start working that uh, particular lead. So that's how Conversion Monster is going to work with Command. It's not free, just so you know. Um, there is a price, there's a monthly fee, and then there's a fee per lead that they work, but they work every lead for up to 12 months and they follow up uh, I believe 17 times over the course of the first 10 or 14 days. And then if they don't reach that person, they will continuously reach out once or twice a month through text, email, or phone call over the next 12 months. But it's uh, it's not very expensive. Um, they'll release pricing soon if they haven't already. And it's something that you can kind of use a la carte. So if you don't want them to follow up with leads on a particular campaign, you just won't tag it CM start. If you do, um, then you tag it CM start and they start interacting. Now, if it's some time later, you want them to interact with leads uh, that you didn't have them interact with previously that are a little bit old, you can go into those leads and just add the tag CM start to their profile. And then Conversion Monster will start engaging with older leads as well. So it's going to be a great service. I've been using it for years. I'm super happy that it's finally coming to fruition within command. And I uh, just wanted to give you guys a little insight into how it works. It's going to be super fun. Um, the, it's supposed to be launching uh, the week of the 12th, 13th, the week of the 14th of June. So we shall see. Either way, it's coming really soon. All right. Thanks, guys, for watching. Uh, don't forget to subscribe to the channel, and we'll see you next time.